Morning, a lot of mixed reaction after last night's first and only vice presidential debate. This debate was less combative and tense compared to last week's presidential version. Topics included the economy, criminal justice and the Supreme Court. The impact of the pandemic led the debate and remained a focus throughout the night. Senator Kamala Harris accused the Trump administration of covering up early knowledge of the coronavirus threat and vowed to take Dr. Anthony Fauci's word if a vaccine is introduced, but not President Trump's. Vice President Mike Pence defended the administration's efforts to contain the pandemic. They knew and they covered it up. The president said it was a hoax. They minimized the seriousness of it. We were able to see to the delivery of billions of supplies so our doctors and nurses had the resources support they needed. And we began really before the month of February was our to develop a vaccine. The final question came from an eighth grader who asked about how both candidates would bring the divided country together. Vice President Pence said politicians debate on stage but come together in times of need. And Senator Harris said Joe Biden has a history of working with politicians across the aisle. The big question now, what's next for the presidential debates after President Trump's COVID diagnosis? As of this morning, it's still set for a week from today on October 15th. But Joe Biden says there should not be a debate if the president is still contagious.